So H3H3 got into a beef with Abba and Preach. And I will say that I am somewhat biased towards Abba and Preach. I've been watching them probably since middle school. But I, I think it's pretty clear cut who's in the right here. This all started off when Ethan Klein interviewed this guy that was like, oh, you should have a Lambo by like 23, 24, something, something ridiculous like that. And if you're 23, 24 watching this video, I would guess you don't have a Lambo. So I, I think you would agree that that's stupid. Okay. Most people aren't going to make it big. Most people aren't going to be rich. That's just the reality. And more than likely, you're going to have to be rich to have a, Lam a Lamborghini. That's just how things work. That's how money is. But moving past that, basically the guy was like, hey, I want you know someone who's with me to dress a certain way, which has been an argument for way too long. It's been a dumb argument for even longer. I, I hate it. Okay. Ever since I, it seems like since I got on social media, that has been an argument. Would you let your girl go out dressed like this? And then you go in the comments and it's the woman saying, oh, if you can't let your girl dress this way and that way, oh, you're insecure. And then there's the men replying. And if, if you can't, if you have to go out to dress like this, who are you trying to impress? And it's just back and forth and back and forth and back and forth like dude first of all can we, can we just let this go please like I'm, I'm i'm begging i'm asking like this argument in and of itself has been tiring okay if you want to set a boundary in your relationship that's your right okay so anyone who tells you oh no nah, man that's not right that's not fair you can't say that you want a woman you're with to dress a certain way. That's not okay, man. They're not a smart person, okay? Just point blank. They're not a smart person. They're probably not a person you should waste time talking to because they more than likely don't have something worth value to say. You should not have to change your, unless your like boundaries are just ridiculous, you shouldn't have to change them for some random person. And you surely should not change them for somebody on the internet. My goodness. Don't let somebody, you know, sitting behind a, a podcast equipment, a podcast setup, you know, making millions of dollars a year affect how you be yourself and how you go about your day and how you set up relationships, okay? Because that person doesn't live the life that you live. This whole thing is just so dumb to me. Like, I, I hate every time it comes up, okay? Which is why I wanted to, wanted to talk about it. it. It's a dumb argument. It's dumb to bring it up. It's not worth bringing up. But people keep harping on it, okay? If you want your girlfriend, your wife, your husband, your boyfriend to dress a certain way, to act a certain way, so that they don't go over your boundaries, and they refuse to accept those boundaries, then move on, okay? And that goes, like I said, that goes for everyone, everyone. Don't let your boundaries be crossed just because somebody on the internet said, oh, girl, you should dress however you want. Dude, you should do whatever you want. Blah, 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 blah. Dude, girl, whoever, be respectful of your partner. Be respectful of the people around you and you will have a pretty good life. Okay. At least, you know, social. I don't, I'm not speaking to financial. I'm not speaking to your relationships i'm talking about purely socially if as long as you respect people and their boundaries you'll be fine and as long as you set healthy boundaries you will be fine you you have to set boundaries somewhere so if you want to say hey i don't want you dressing this certain way and i don't want you going to this place that should be respected if you know whoever you're with disagrees talk about it like it feels like people are so wrapped up in trying to be like, oh, I'm so independent, blah, blah, blah. That they've forgotten how to have a conversation. They've forgotten to just sit there and be like, hmm, I disagree with you setting this boundary. So let's talk about it. Instead of sitting there and being like, oh, well, you're just insecure. You're an insecure person. Like, dude, whatever. If you're insecure, whatever. All right. Everyone's insecure about something. And that's unfortunate. Okay. But I, I don't want to say that it's controlling. I think that it's setting a boundary and you should be with somebody who's comfortable with the boundaries you set and they should respect them. That's just the way I feel. So I'm going to end it off here. Thank you all so much for watching. 
check out more of my channel if you like the video if you like this video make sure that you go down and like this video subscribe if you want to see more i also have my second channel which i will be dropping the man of steel video on tomorrow if you like video game reviews movie reviews show reviews we've got it all over there so go check it out goodbye